So welcome to uh, Captain Cocktail, the first outing. Um, it could be also Captain's blog, I'm not sure which one quite yet. Uh, but this is the first time that um, I've, I've had this idea for a long while about interviewing people, whether um, uh, friends of mine who are, are lookalikes, um, like me, I'm, or I'm just like, ended up looking like Patrick Stewart, it's not my fault, all right, honestly. Um, so, uh, and being a Trekkie is a bonus, it really is. Um, I'm luckily that, that um, I'm able now that, to encompass it and, and see where it's going. Um, so, watch this space. So, I've come to West London to introduce you to a friend of mine called Keith. And he's been a, a dear and lifelong friend and he agreed to be the, the first culprit to do um, Captain, Captain Cocktail. Um, so, we, 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 we're going to have a couple of glasses of pins, we're going to talk about uh, his, his uh, interest in music, or well, shared interest in music, really. Um, so he's going to introduce us this this machine of his. So we're listening to some Joni Mitchell. So it's, it's really nice at the moment. Um, so um, I'm, I'm going to introduce you to Keith, and he's going to show you how this uh, this wonderful machine works. Uh, and then we'll get a couple of fascinating facts along the way. So um, engage. Thank you for inviting us You're into your home You're and showing us a passion of yours, which is um, synthesizer. What what is this? It's a modular synthesizer over the top bit that we're talking about. Yeah, um, uh, more sort of modern synthesizer underneath and the mixer. But yeah, what we're talking about today is the modular synthesizer. Okay, so um, this has been a fascination for you for uh, a long time. Long time. Yeah. I wanted one since I was about fifteen or something. And it's taken me to a lot of later in my life to sort of get it together, but yeah, you know, obviously there's a few holes in it left, but, and you know, maybe another rack in the future, but yeah, you know, I'm loving it at the moment. And it's a breath of fresh air from a computer, this is good, I enjoy it. Okay, so cheers. Yeah, thumbs up. Here's to an introduction of um, some Star Trek noises, some space theme noises, as well as some um, musical inspired. Uh, where, where the noises came from, produced by this machine. So with uh, Keith's able fingers and some pieces of, what are they? Patch cords. Patch cords? Yes. So a patch cord, is it? a patch cord. That's one of the... Yeah, these are... Um, What's one of these? These are uh, 3.5mm ones. Like old school modular synthesizers, it used to be the size of your wall. Yes. But a few years ago, 10 years ago, some German guy I for sort of went for the miniaturised format that went into these sort of racks. So, a wall size thing goes into a smaller stuff and the cables get smaller. Okay. Fabulous. Yeah. Smaller fingers, but that's it, denser. Wonderful. Well, um, anyway, so uh, Captain Cocktail, here's Captain, his, Cocktail. Here's Captain Cocktail. Cheers. Let's uh, sit back and enjoy um, uh, some, some interesting sounds. So, we need to start uh, with. A noise. What, I mean, how is a noise produced? I know about white noise, but but what, show me white noise. Uh, well, so white noise. Uh, this unit here will produce a couple of sorts of colours of noise. You get different sorts of colours of noise. You can hear a bit of white noise at the moment. It's very quiet. It's just a little. But if you colour a bit of pink noise, you can hear it a bit better. Okay. okay. That's more like a sort of ocean sound. You can turn it down. Get sort of. That's basically pink noise, which we're going to be using. Oh, so again? This is basically a bit of pink noise. Pink? Wait, well, I, don't, I, I only understand white noise. Uh, just... White noise is this. Uh, if you filter it down, you get kind of um, pink okay. noise. Um, like, uh, I think brown noise is more of a sort of rumble. Brown? What? I've never <laughs> so heard of brown noise. I'll talk about the brown noise. That's another Captain Pop <laughs> show. Um, yeah, but you get blue noise and different sort of colours. It's like the rainbow, you know, you get white light and different shades and colour, different colours of light. So okay. filters from white light. Same thing, white noises and different sorts of shades of noise come out of it. Um, this one you get into the versions of noise there. So you get my meaning so that's yeah. nice. Yeah. That, that's an interesting that's sort of you see. You can't do a lot with sine waves on their own. Oh, I see. So, so these are the, the, the shape of the wave. That's it. Yeah. Oh, I see. So, do that one again. That's the sawtooth. It starts getting these ones start getting okay. quite harmonically rich, and then you start filtering things out. So okay. We'll give us that yeah, one again, and then do the other two. That's my nice. sawtooth. Uh, this is the square wave, which you can adjust a bit. So it's like a sort of square, but you can make the squares narrow or, or, or wider. 
Okay. Listen, if you just, sorry, we, we just found this, look, I just pulled, pulled, picked out my tricorder, my old Playmates trusty tricorder, I know it's not really handsome, but anyway, here we go, we've got a noise. It's amazing, isn't it, really, that we come up with a similar noise, which is, I don't know, you know, familiar stuff, isn't it? It all does. Sounds and uh, a worthy uh, hour. Oh, absolutely yeah. lovely cocktail, cat. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. What did I say? Your plot, Nick of the Wood. Uh, Kapla, anything you like. Kapla. Kapla. <laughs> so, Keith, one, one more question to ask you is um, who, which is your favourite Star Trek? Uh, Deep Space and all that. I wonder. Yeah? Why Deep Space Nine? It's the only one I can remember. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? It's the only one you can remember. I've never watched it. <laughs> Don't be silly. No, it's alright. No, Deep Space Nine. <laughs> you should ask me. So, uh, there you have it. It's been a, a most entertaining uh, hour working with, uh, with Keith in West London. Um, we're ending on some beautiful Jenny Mitchell and uh, I hope you've enjoyed this experience. Captain Cocktail will be uh, coming back. Um, not sure which, which direction she's going to get, but um, why not? <laughs>